Hey there! In this video, we're diving into everything you need to know about OBD2 trouble code P0420, also known as Catalyst System Efficiency Below Threshold for Bank 1. First things first, let's break down what the P0420 code actually is. This code gets triggered when the engine control module detects a condition that indicates that the catalytic converter is operating below the minimum allowable efficiency threshold. The purpose of a catalytic converter is to use a chamber called a catalyst to change the harmful compounds from an engine's emissions into environmentally safe gases. When the engine releases harmful gases like carbon monoxide, nitrogen oxides, and hydrocarbons, these gases travel through the catalyst and are converted into safer gases like steam, carbon dioxide, and nitrogen. When Bank 1 catalytic converter efficiency below threshold, the ECM flags it as a problem and triggers the P0420 trouble code. Now let's learn what is Bank 1 catalytic converter. In engines with multiple cylinder banks like V6 or V8 engines, you'll have two sides or banks of cylinders. Bank 1 typically refers to the side of the engine where cylinder 1 is located and Bank 2 is on the opposite side. Each bank has its own exhaust line, and each exhaust line is equipped with a catalytic converter. So, when we talk about Bank 1 catalytic converter, we are focusing on catalytic converter specifically attached to the Bank 1 exhaust line. If you want to read more about any other OBD2 codes, you can visit our website obdcode.org for a full list of codes and their meanings. Now let's dive into the details of why P0420 gets triggered. The catalytic converter's job is to reduce harmful gases like carbon monoxide, nitrogen oxides, and hydrocarbons. To ensure it's working correctly, the oxygen sensors monitor the oxygen levels in the exhaust gases. The catalytic converter has two oxygen sensors, one located upstream before the converter and one downstream after it. The ECU compares the readings from the upstream and downstream oxygen sensors. If the catalytic converter is functioning properly, the downstream sensor should show significantly lower oxygen content compared to the upstream sensor. The P0420 code is triggered when the ECU detects that both upstream and downstream oxygen sensors are showing similar readings. Now where exactly are the P0420 sensors located? Catalytic converters typically resemble exhaust mufflers and are integrated into the exhaust system upstream of the actual mufflers. The oxygen sensors are strategically placed on either side of the catalytic converter. The upstream sensor is positioned before the catalytic converter, and the downstream sensor is located after the catalytic converter. Now that we understand what P0420 means and where the sensor is located, let's cover how to reset it. Sometimes, error codes like P0420 appear due to recent maintenance or temporary glitches, and they may clear up after an OBD2 reset. To do this, you'll need an OBD2 scanner. If you don't have one, check out the link in the description for the best scanners out there. Simply connect the scanner to your vehicle, follow the instructions to clear the trouble codes, and see if the P0420 code reappears. If the P0420 code reappears, it's time to look into some common root causes of P0420. Let's discuss some common root causes of the P0420 error code. The first cause is faulty oxygen sensor. Sometimes the oxygen sensor itself may fail due to wear or contamination. The next cause is faulty oxygen sensor heater circuit. Oxygen sensors need to reach a specific temperature to work effectively, which is why many have an integrated heater. A faulty heater circuit can prevent the sensor from reaching optimal operating temperature, resulting in incorrect readings. The third cause is defective sensor wiring or circuit problems. Issues like a blown fuse, broken wires, or poor connections in the oxygen sensor circuit can disrupt the signal to the ECU, causing the P0420 code. The fourth cause is inefficient catalytic converter. When the catalytic converter becomes inefficient, it fails to adequately reduce harmful emissions, which the oxygen sensors pick up on. The fifth cause is a bad spark plug. If the spark plug is faulty or worn out, 
the combustion process might not be completed properly. This leaves unburnt fuel and oxygen in the exhaust gases. The sixth cause is cylinder misfire. When a cylinder misfires, the unburnt air fuel mixture gets pushed straight into the exhaust system. This means the catalytic converter has to process excess fuel and oxygen, which can strain its efficiency. The seventh cause is a leaking fuel injector, or high fuel pressure. A leaking fuel injector continuously sprays fuel into the combustion chamber, even when it's not needed. Similarly, high fuel pressure forces excess fuel into the engine. Both issues can result in too much fuel entering the exhaust system. This excess fuel can cause unburnt fuel to accumulate in the exhaust, leading to a clogged catalytic converter over time. A clogged converter becomes less efficient at neutralizing harmful gases.